Just the one defeat at home all season in the PL2 for the Seagulls. Andrew Crofts will be hoping it stays that way tonight as his side welcome Chelsea to the Amex for their final home game of the campaign. Williams straight onto the head of Turns. And that's a decent switch from Ben Elliott. Brooking, who picked up that yellow card earlier. He's made the return run. Vale arrowing towards the area. Skips in field of Moran. Brings back Brooking into play. Thought maybe he was offside, but the ball is into Lewis Hall. And there is the opener for relegation threat in Chelsea. He had a decent chance earlier, Lewis Hall. This time he makes no mistake from point-blank range. Williams now. Sliding challenge from Leonard. Can't prevent Ballo picking it up. Left edge of the area here. Moves inside of a fire. And then tees it up for Simons, who blazes it over with the side of his foot. Excellent chance to double the visitors' lead. Now then, Sarmiento. Cutting in field, the run's been made ahead of him. Over on this near side, though, is Baker Boati. Bit of space for him, takes it first time. A slight blunder there from Sharman Lowe, but he does grab it at the second time of asking. Leonard drops the shoulder away from Hall and then gets it back from Furlong. It's now, it's Furlong on the return and narrowly wide of Sharman Lowe's goal. Oh, lovely flick that from Ferguson. Does incredibly well just to keep it in as well. Still going here, Ferguson. In for Moran to the bottom corner, just wide. Now then, Ferguson chests it down well. In towards Miller on the edge of the area, just wide again. Grazes the foot of that left post. Spong with the ball down the centre towards Miller. Offside flag stays down. Oh, and he's gone for the lob just over from Todd Miller. Well, he's been at the heart of the action, Miller, in the last five minutes or so. Another glorious chance for the former Colchester United player. Leonard, well, he hasn't gone sportingly back straight up to Perpion. Ferguson thunders it towards the bottom right corner. Good stop that from Sharman Lowe. And now Chelsea up the other end of the pitch with a chance to double their lead. Oh, and the, straight to the spot. Points James Durkin. He was in absolutely no doubt. The incident just inside the left edge of the area. So then, Wareham rolls it into the bottom left corner and sends Tom McGill the wrong way. How important a goal could that be for Chelsea? Come at the end of next weekend. Loads of space over on that far side. Can they switch the play through Joe Hay? They can. Ballo over to the left flank. Low strike comes in, and that's a really smart stop down to his left from Tom McGill. Miller doing the pressing there, but Sharman Lowe was able to find him Boyamba, but he can't find his way out of trouble. This is Moran now. Can he make them pay? Deflected effort. It's gone in. Well, Sharman Lowe did enough, Umboy Amber didn't. And the deflected effort gives the Seagulls a lifeline. In it goes then. Oh, just off the top right corner. Excellent effort that. As Chelsea looked to find the third of the evening, they were millimetres away from it there. Tom McGill, I think, was well beaten. Furlong keeps it in play. Whips one in towards Tolage again, maybe thinking about the acrobatic effort. But there'll be no time for the Albion leveller. And that will do it as a disappointing end to Brighton's season at home in the PL2. They've got one more to go. But this evening here, it's finished. Brighton and Hove Albion 1, Chelsea 2.